Well guys, I'm down here at the horse stables and there's a little bit of remnants of, uh, I don't know if you can see it or not, but there's a purple balloon still here. There's a deer over here. I hope y'all seen that. It's kind of cool to see while I'm down here, but just wanted to, uh, say that um the day that summer went missing was the trip down here to this swim hole was it planned did candace come down here to maybe meet somebody that was going to uh, play a part in this investigation. Does anybody that Candace and Don know, do they have ties to, anybody that they know have ties to Colonial Heights area in Tennessee? I can tell you, I sure wouldn't go swimming in this. But, uh, yeah, I got to thinking about it. And I do know that there are a lot of uh, drug deals that go on in this parking lot, or that used to be. Some of the various stuff goes on here. Used to. So I wonder, because what makes me say that is, um, Candace said that they just came here real quick until the, oh, there's that deer. You see it, guys? There's one of them. Uh, they just basically came up here until the prescriptions got ready, right? But JLR said let me see if i can zoom in on him y'all see him over there but jlr said that uh um or not jlr jlr done a video up here one day and uh there's that deer y'all see him? uh the girl at the horse stable says that uh um uh, they were up here for most of the day, so it don't make sense. Why would be why would they be up here for most of the day if uh, they were just up here until the prescriptions got ready and then left? I don't think they had any plans on going swimming. That don't make sense either. Right. I think the only plans Candace had was to uh you know, get the prescriptions ready and, uh, you know, get, get them, get them picked up for granny. I think there's a couple deer up here, guys. Figured I'd take a walk on back on this trail that comes from the parking lot of the swim hole. But, uh, yeah, just something weird about that. I mean, if it's only going to take... 30 minutes to an hour to fill the prescription and they didn't you know as candace says it was just going to be a quick thing that's what she told chris mcdonough then there's the discrepancy here somewhere because the horse stables girl says that uh they were out here for most of the day doesn't make sense and I think Candace said that they didn't stay out here too long either. So what's up with that? Thought I saw a twisted uh, twisted tea can there, but I didn't. It's the it's actually a tea real tea can, brisk. But uh, um, yeah, guys. 
if she was just going to be here for a quick thing, why even go swimming? And why would the uh, lady at the horse stable say that uh, there's a few flowers, guys. Why would the lady at the horse stables say that they were up here for most of the day? She said that vehicle was up here for most of the day. Interesting, huh? So, I wonder if Candace... What all happened up here that day besides just swimming, guys? What all actually did happen up here that day? Some people say Grandma wasn't even here. You know what I mean? There's a boat out there. Hope y'all enjoy this beautiful scenery. I feel like Michelle walks doing this. <laughs> Michelle after dark. But, uh, yeah, guys, I mean, what really happened out here that day? Did Candace meet someone? That is from around or has connections to the Colonial Heights area. Don't know. I mean, did she meet someone out here that has a connection to what happened to Summer that day? Makes you wonder. Got a steep drop off there. I have no idea where this trail goes, guys, but... I turn around here in just a minute so yeah I just wanted to come out here and while I was in town doing some filming shoot this for you here there's something out here guys there's clearing out here let's go check it out because seeing how they stayed out here for most of the day per the horse stables lady what'd they do out here for that long did Candace meet someone out here and plan something for later that day? Just a thought. Wow. Ooh, big spider web, guys. Big spider web. What well, goes up the mountain there, don't it? Ooh, I just seen something here, guys. I just seen something. Look at here, it's steep right here. This is steep. Now you have to walk out here quite a ways, guys, from the parking lot, which I don't know if anybody's ever done. But remember, there was something going around about Summer hitting her head on a rock. Let me take you down here and show you something. I don't know if anybody's ever been out here that far. And everybody's saying, well, there's no rocks out there at the swimming hole, right? Pretty steep going up through there. Pretty steep, guys. Well, there's no rock Summer could have hit her head on. Look at there. What about a There's some rocks right there. Let me zoom out here, guys. There's about a six foot drop right here. And there's some rocks under the water right there. Right there. Could they have, uh, somebody's been out here fishing. Could they have maybe come out here and uh, maybe Summer fell and hit her head on that rock? On that rock? Now this is, uh, there's the bridge out there I used to jump off of. See if I could zoom in on that. I used to jump off that bridge. That's the bridge that comes over here to the uh, horse stables. But, uh,
Yeah, I mean, I could, if I wasn't paying attention, you know, whatever, I could definitely fall off there and hit a, you know, land on that rock. Um, or, you know, what's to say they weren't backing up here, guys? I can see myself doing this back in the day, depending on how deep that is, you know, and uh, running down here and just jumping as far as I can out there into the lake. You know what I mean? But what happens if you don't jump far enough? Well, you land right there. Maybe on these rocks. Could that have been what happened? Just having fun out here. You know. Back out here. It's a pretty steep bank right here, guys. It gets a lot of, uh, I would say it gets a lot of traffic right here. Fish, people fishing. With those rocks being there, it would be a good fishing area. But also, I wonder if people jump in right here too. Oh, I see what it is, guys. I see what it is. Hey, hold on just a second. I just seen something, guys. Hang on just a second. Because this used to be my old stomping grounds. I'm going to show you something. Y'all see what I see? Talk about jumping. Talk about jumping in. What's that, guys? It's a rope. So they were going into the water out here. There's a rope. They were swinging into the lake out here a while back. Holy crap. Holy crap. So this is a recreational. Were they jumping off here in summer, hit that rock? Holy crap, guys. I just now seen that rope. Here I am talking about jumping in right there. And people were actually, they've been, they've been doing that all this time. Shit. So I got a question now. Did Hunter and Summer come out here? And she got hurt? What the hell? Look at there, guys. That rope. Huh. Interesting. Well, let me know what you think, guys. Let me know what you think. I didn't know I was going to find this out here. But, uh... Huh. Well, maybe Candace didn't come out here and meet anybody. Maybe Summer did get hurt. You know. Just some real-time uh, exploring. Real-time questions. Real-time scenarios, guys. Now, I've, I've went back, back in here. It's a pretty good hike. Now, I don't know if any other YouTubers been back here or not. Like I said, this used to be my old... I, I've never been... Like, even in my old stomping grounds, I've never been back here. <clears throat> we used to jump off that bridge out there, though. Um, I mean, hell, for all I know, Summer could have slipped and fell down this embankment right here and hit her head on one of them rocks down there and Hunter had to go get her. Or it could have happened back there. Now that I see that place back there has some recreation or did have some recreational use... Don't look like it does now. <clears throat> Wonder why. Um, could something have happened back there and Summer got hurt? I wonder now, guys. I really wonder. So, I come out here just to really think that, uh, you know, could Candace have met somebody out here 
that uh, was maybe planning on picking summer up on Ben Hill Road that day. That's what I come out here for. I'm telling you, people meet people out here. And they meet them out here for nefarious reasons. Or they used to. I don't know about now. But a lot of drug deals go on out here in this parking lot because it's secluded. You know what I mean? So I wonder now, maybe if Hunter and Summer went exploring. Did Hunter know about that place out there? Did Summer get hurt out there? There are rocks right there where nobody ever walked out there. You know what I mean? So everybody that has went to like right here know there's no rocks. No rocks at all. Just mud and a nasty place to go swimming. Right? So, damn guys, now I wonder, I really wonder now, did Hunter come running back down through this trail with Summer, maybe after she hit her head, I wonder, could be a possibility, I'm not saying that's what happened, I'm just saying, damn, what a discovery. Anyway, guys, I'm going to go back to the car and uh, go do some more filming in some other places. Let me know what you think. Drop some comments below on what you what you think I just found there. You know, do y'all think it's a possibility? Because, again, I'll show it to you right here. You know, there's, there's no rocks. It's just all mud. Nasty, nasty mud. Nasty place to go swimming. But out there, back there, way back yonder, back there, yeah. Yeah. So, guys, let me know what you think. That's a hell of a discovery back there, guys. Uh, makes me, uh, I'll have to be honest with you, it really makes me take a, a step back and, you know, Wonder what all did happen up here. A couple scenarios, you know what I mean? A couple scenarios. Everything from did, you know, Candace meet somebody up here for nefarious reasons? Or, you know, did Hunter and Summer and she got hurt? I mean, you got to think, she's just five years old. So, well, let me know what you think, guys. And uh, I'll be back on later on with another video. Thanks for hanging with me.